Oh, yeah, the light needs to be towards me. Hmm, okay, maybe I'll turn it over here. No, how about... Oh my god! My phone! How would you people do this? I need to sneeze. Oh my god. Get this off. <laughs> Welcome to the future! I'm in the bathroom. Ask no questions, but I'll tell you anyway. It's because of the lighting. It's just really good, and I kind of like this color right here. Kind of matches with my hair. As you can see, kind of pinkish, and then we have some grayish tones over here now. So the challenge is already over. But I'm not gonna tell you what happened until the very end of the video. What is this challenge about? Trying to starve myself. I'm kidding, that is definitely not what it is. But I promise you, I haven't taken a single bite of food. And here's why. Although my sister said this totally sounds sponsored, but obviously isn't. Because who would sponsor me? I have less than 100 subscribers. It doesn't work that way. I just really like this product, so that's why I sound this way. Recently, I posted a video about a product called Jimmy Joy. And if you've watched it, you know what it's all about, but if you haven't, I'll tell you briefly. So they have these shakes, this is an example, this is mango, and inside these bags is a complete meal replacement. So what that means is you don't have to consume any other food other than this and you can survive. So basically, in this particular one, it's a powder. They also have other ones, which is a pre-made drink and they have bars as well. You can find all of them on their website. I found out about them not too long ago, maybe like one or two months ago. So as you can see here, it says 100% nutrition, 26 vitamins and minerals, and then you have 100 grams of protein, it's plant-based, vegetarian, which is very important since I'm vegetarian, and then you have high fiber, high three omega, and all of the things that you need basically in a day and in your life except for the part that you can't chew this food hence the title of my video so i could have chosen to get the bars but they're more expensive and i wanted to see if i could survive on a solely liquid diet all you have to do is add 300 milliliters of water that's one portion of a serving that they recommend you add two scoops of this and you shake it up in your shaker and then basically that's it you know don't have to cook and no preparation really other than two minutes of that you or even two minutes like a minute I want to see if I'm able to survive on a liquid diet for six days and if I eat nothing else other than the Jimmy Joe product, what will happen to my face, to my weight, to my overall mood throughout the day? Will anything change? Will it stay the same? Will I be craving food? We'll find out everything if you just keep watching. For day one, I'm going to weigh myself. 52.3 on day one of the Jimmy Joy challenge. It is half past nine in the morning and here is my first meal of the day. I'm going to be doing this challenge for six days and my first meal is going to be the chocolate shake. So I'm going to have 400 calories and I'm going to keep you updated and tell you how long it lasts me for. So I've got 300 milliliters of water in that in my plenty shaker and now with the scoop that I got, I'm going to add two scoops of the powder. Shake, shake, shake. And that's my first meal of the day. Hey guys, it is 3 p.m. and I have just had my second meal. I have been so caught up in doing something. I wanted to finish all my tasks so that I totally forgot to eat, although I was starting to feel hungry since like one or t like half past one so um yeah at this point i was literally starving myself so i was like okay i'm gonna stop doing what i'm doing and i'm gonna film this and just drink this thing <laughs> however i was too hungry to film the process of making the drink so i drank it first and now i'm filming but i think i'm gonna have another one because i'm just so hungry and it's been 
five and a half hours is my first meal, which is not what I was supposed to do. I think I was supposed to eat in like three or four hours or something. I don't know. All right, so I'm having my third meal right now. I'm having vanilla and it is 3.51. So yeah, I'm just gonna have this because like I said before, I was so hungry. So yeah. Um, I always need to remember to open this away from me because otherwise it's just going to burst in my face. Not always, but sometimes, so. All good. <laughs> mm. I put like 400 milliliters of water this time, although you, it says you're supposed to put 300. And it is a lot more watery, definitely. It feels and tastes different. 9 p.m. and I'm about 25 to 20 minutes away from home. Here's my bike, but I'm really hungry. I have three meals today in total, so I should have had one more, but I don't know how I forgot. I need to get better at this. Anyway, see you soon. Oh my god, I just smelled Chinese takeaway. Oh, it smells so good. It's kind of weird whenever I'm hungry. I'm always like, oh, I wish I had Jimmy Joe right now so that I don't have to prepare food. But now that I've made myself actually eat Jimmy Joe every day, I'm really craving real food. I mean, this also real food, but you know, like conventional food. So, I don't know. I really just want a Subway or something. <laughs> yeah, it's almost, I'm almost there. I'm halfway home. Last meal of the day, I think. It is half past 10 p.m. This is my fourth meal. Yeah, I think I should have had five meals, but we'll see how tomorrow goes. Good night. Day two, meal number one. I have my planner here where I keep track of all my meals and all that kind of stuff. And I gotta say, I've been feeling kind of bloated yesterday, so I hope that's gonna go away. But I'm not really sure what's causing it which ingredient in the Jimmy Joy. It is 1 p.m. and time for lunch, so today I'm having vanilla. This is my second meal of the day. I don't really know what to say. It's kind of weird. I'm really craving food that you can chew. So, uh, I, I was thinking of quitting this challenge and not doing the whole video thing, but I'm gonna get through it because I want to see what's gonna happen with my weight, what's gonna happen with my face, is there gonna be any noticeable changes, and just generally how I feel from the inside out. I have noticed that I don't have as much bloating as yesterday, however, there is still such a weird feeling in my stomach all the time. I mean, my <laughs> I feel like I'm full of balloons. My intestines feel like one giant big blown up balloon. So I don't know, maybe it's the protein. My boyfriend says it could probably be the protein because I probably don't take as much protein as I need every day because I'm vegetarian. Although I do eat various foods and I'm pretty sure I eat a healthy diet. This is just totally different. And another thing that I've noticed is my throat is kind of tight now. I'm not sure if that's because of the non-chewing that I that has been going on for the past day and a half or because I was running today or just because I'm not feeling well. Kind of irritating. I drank tea and it didn't really help. Oh, I don't know. I really, It's only a day and a half and I really don't want to continue with this challenge anymore but I'm going to get through it. Look at those cookies. I really want to eat them. Maybe I should get some chewing gum. I think chewing gum shouldn't be counted in as food because it isn't. So that might help with the chewing problem. 5 p.m. and I'm having my meal number three. Just finished a quick workout and it's time for my last meal of the day, which happens to be meal four. Yeah, I haven't had five meals again today, but I don't know. I haven't really been feeling hungry at all. I mean, 
obviously like I haven't been feeling hungry enough to have five meals so um, yeah today I'm having mango for dinner day 3 9 30 a.m. I'm gonna have breakfast mango shake 2 p.m. meal number two I'm having chocolate and as you can see this is just a sticker with all the information taped on a, a plain bag. Apologies, due to increased demand, we ran out of printed pouches, but remember, beauty comes from the inside and our shake is still the same. Meal number three, it is half past seven. I really don't know how I forgot to eat again, but I'm mixing chocolate and vanilla this time. So we'll see how it tastes when I shake it up. We're going to give it a good shake so that all the powder is melted. Tastes more like vanilla than chocolate. Tastes good. I actually quite like this. Last meal of the day. Meal number four. Mango. Good morning. It is day four. I don't know what's happening to my face, but I don't know if you can see. There are like these pimples, acne. I have no idea. I've tried to cover them as much as I can with concealer but underneath they're super red and I don't really know if that's because of Jimmy Joy because I've just you know abruptly changed my whole diet in three days or what's happening but yeah my face looks terrible and then I have been less bloated the last day than the first day and then the second day was kind of better so that kind of improved over time however yesterday I was trying to finish my last meal of the day which was the fourth Jimmy Joy shake mango and I was just not having it so I was drinking it for like an hour or something and then I had a little bit left and I was like nope not gonna drink this and I just washed it out because I cannot live on this anymore for the whole time it's just too much so this challenge was supposed to be six days long and Sorry to say, but it's gonna be three days long. Right now, I'm going to Aldi and I'm gonna buy myself the best vegetarian pizza that they have. And I'm gonna eat that like I've never had pizza before. Aldi, here I come. These three days have been feeling like forever. Ooh, look at all of them. Which one should I get? Most of them are not vegetarian, but maybe this one. Yes. Challenge is over. It's time to see. See if I've gained or lost any weight. 51.9. Okay, appears as if I have lost some weight. Now it says I had 52.2 at the beginning. Now I have 51.9. So I have no idea if this is because of Jimmy Joy or just, you know, because of something else. I have no idea, but um. Yeah, like you see, I said I can't do it anymore, so I'm quitting this challenge. Welcome back. I was going to go somewhere else and change the background, but I actually really like how this whole look works with my look, my own look right now. So I don't know if I'm gonna do that. Yeah, I'm gonna just turn around my phone. Look at my little stand. I'm gonna put my phone on there. Please don't fall. Hallelujah. <sighs> so yeah, it's been three days. I couldn't survive for six days only drinking Jimmy Joy. I'm sorry Jimmy Joy, you're a great brand and your products did keep me full but just having that taste in my mouth every single meal for every day was just too much. Obviously, if I didn't have anything else to eat, I could survive on this. And I proved that because I wasn't hungry. But the problems that I noticed were 
in the first day I felt super bloated especially in the morning of the second day then it kind of went away throughout the second day and in the third day I didn't really feel bloated and I don't really feel bloated today I was craving food you know other food so badly I saw these biscuits on a table and rice and baked potatoes and there was popcorn and I was just like oh my god I wish I could just take a bite of this food <laughs> but no I was persistent and I didn't for half the length of the challenge and then half of it I was like you know I'm not gonna suffer through this anymore because I don't want Jimmy Joy to be something that I end up hating because it's actually great just not for every single meal use just like with any food really you know yourself if you eat something constantly like if you make a meal and then you make too much and then you have to eat that that day and then you have to eat it the next day you're obviously gonna not you know you're obviously not gonna want to eat it anymore especially after the second day so yesterday night was the worst i was having my fourth meal which somehow i happen to have only four meals per day which is 1600 calories although it says you're supposed to have kind of five meals a day but i don't know i was really hungry and I was actually running and exercising throughout these days as well and I still didn't feel like having another meal. But the next day, <laughs> I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna have pizza. And then I had a pizza this morning, but it didn't really feel like enough. It felt like an empty feeling in my stomach. I don't know, it felt like I didn't have enough nutrients. But I actually felt like, oh my god, this pizza is not filling me up as it's supposed to because my body kind of got adjusted to eating nutritionally complete meals in the last three days. And then actually I did have another uh, plenty shake vanilla this afternoon for lunch because I forgot to make my lunch, so... I just grabbed that and went to the bus station and it was totally fine. I think I just needed that one meal in between the Jimmy Joy meals like to break apart the textures and the flavors because after the pizza I didn't feel like I didn't want to drink Jimmy Joy ever again. I just felt like fine again. I was like yeah I can drink this stuff again but yeah maybe like every other meal would be fine. So another thing that I noticed, and I'm not sure if this is because of the plenty shakes or because of some other factor, although I didn't change anything else other than what I eat, my face is looking pretty bad. Um, I don't know if you can see that, but I have these terrible, terrible red pimples and they're like inside the skin. So I try to cover them up as much as I can but they are still visible. Although not as visible as in real life. In real life, they look much worse. So I don't know if that is something to do with the shakes. And then regarding weight, I actually have 300 grams less. I'm gonna guess that that's because I was on a liquid diet. I think that's it. If you're interested in a more thorough review of this product where I talk about all the prices, the nutritional value, the flavors. You should watch my other video, which is called Jimmy Joy Review. Thanks so much for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.